you go out to the woods today, you'd better protect your skin. Today what we're doing is we're having a rally for awareness, uh, just to make people aware of Lyme disease and how you can track it, what the uh, symptoms are. The ticks are critters that like to bite if ever you let them in. Lyme disease is a great imitator. It uh, mimics a lot of other diseases, so people tend to get misdiagnosed and aren't treated properly. So we're just here fighting for better testing and better treatment. A little bite, the prickle of pain, can put your whole life in a tailspin. About two years ago, she started losing her voice, she started tremoring, um, had trouble swallowing and uh, nausea and like just her hair loss, like heart palpitations, like all these things. It's just, and we just, um, yeah, it's been, it's been tough. I don't know what more else to say, I just hope no one else gets it, you know. That's all. Sorry. Emotional. You best beware, you teddy bears, on a picnic. I hope we brought some awareness to the idea that you can get Lyme disease in Alberta. You can get it across Canada. And it's a very treatable disease if you catch it early. And so we want to make sure that people, if they suspect it's Lyme disease, please do something about it. Because late Lyme is a terrible disease and it takes months of antibiotic to get better. And it's so treatable when you catch it early. And right now we're just not seeing a lot of people get the diagnosis early. The time has come for all smart daddies to make demands from steady Eddie a Lyme disease action plan.